All right. We are officially live. Welcome to our live Live Good Firestarter Friday rank recognition training Zoom for this awesome Friday, September 15th, 2023. We just went over 700,000 paid members in nine months. Nader, has that ever been done before? Can I, am I the only one that can't hear Nader? Nobody can hear Nader. <laughs> sorry, sorry. I've been so excited. N never, ever. <laughs> 700,000 people? Ever. Companies in 20 years in the industry don't do that. Oh, keep going. Keep going. Awesome. All right. We've got a packed call today. Some amazing speakers. I'm going to bring them on here in a second. But let's jump right in. we got a lot of awesome stuff to talk about. Let's jump right into our rank advancements. Another big week. Now, here's something I want to kind of mention first, because this is really, really exciting to me and kind of something we talked about, I remember, on the June 9th. Uh, Firestarter Friday Zoom. I remember that just because I was traveling that day. That's why I remember the date. But we talked about how, so I'm going to my email with the new diamonds and rank recognition. Um, we talked about how, you know, at the beginning, you need to be affiliate heavy. In, in other words, most of the people coming aboard are affiliates or distributors who are going to go out there and recruit and build and find new customers and distributors and members and all that stuff. And now, you know, as we mature, <laughs> uh, those numbers kind of flip-flop and because people were talking about you know it, we talked about on that zoom um some people's concerns and what was out there in the marketplace and all that stuff and so you know we talked about how yes you know because people were saying hey the only people in live good are people who are affiliates and that was you know almost the case we still had a lot of members at the time but now those numbers are not necessarily flip-flopping but a lot more members and customers totally unrelated to the network marketing side, to the affiliate side, are coming on board. And this is what's exciting to me. We yeah. still had a ton of rank advancements, I think more than last week. Our numbers were bigger than last week. Not the biggest week ever, definitely not the smallest week ever, another big week. Our cutoff day was solid, but not one of the biggest. But this is what we've been noticing, especially this week, it kind of really kicked in, is that every day is kind of more consistent. In other words, usually... Thursdays are obviously the biggest. Fridays are actually the second biggest, surprisingly. You would think it was Wednesdays, but it's actually Fridays and then Wednesdays. Sometimes they flip flop. The weekends are usually slow. Monday and Tuesday kind of builds up. Um, every day this week, except for the cutoff day, was bigger than every day last week, which is really exciting. That's what huge. I see from that is that it's people are less, I don't want to say excited about, but less coming in because of the opportunity side and more coming in because of the membership side that has nothing to do with the power line, nothing yes. to do with the features, yes. nothing to do with the cutoff date, the sense of urgency, all that stuff. They're coming yes. aboard when they see it because they want to try these amazing products. They're hearing all the great things, the testimonials, everything that you guys are doing. So it really is, you know, it's kind of, it, it's, you know, it's cool when you predict stuff, but it's really cool when, when those predictions actually happen, like exactly how yes. you predict so uh, it's it's cool to see that, that that is happening, and I think that trend will continue. So um, another awesome week. Congratulations to everybody. You guys are absolutely on fire. And what that says, what I was just talking about, is that you guys are starting to go out and share the products a little bit more than just the opportunity. Again, when we started, it was almost all opportunity, matrix, power line. Now you guys are seeing these products are legit. They okay. work. They are for real. They are changing lives. And when Amen. you guys use them, Amen. You know, other people use them, I mean, that's what's going to build this thing long term. That's what we talk about. You know, if we're going to get to 3 million, 5 million, 10 million members in the next few years, it's going to be on members and customers totally outside of the affiliate space. And the, but the affiliates who are bringing them in and who are positioned in the matrix now are really going to benefit from all of that growth. So that said, another big rate, big week of rank advancements. We had 4,515 new bronzes, another 4,515 bronzes this week alone. Congratulations. And, you know, we talk about how over 30% of our affiliates are in profit, which is unheard of in the industry. But what I want to talk about, not to take anything away from any of our bronzes, silvers, or any of our ranks, 
is that really everybody can be in profit from day one just yes. by ordering product and saving money. I mean, we talk about 30% of affiliates are in profit, but literally we could have 100% of everybody being in profit just by taking advantage of our amazing membership and using these products from day one. So it probably is actually higher than 30% when you look at it from that perspective, because a penny saved is a penny or a dollar saved is a dollar earned. And people are saving a ton of money on these life-changing products and getting the results, getting healthy. And it is awesome. So that said, 4,500 new bronzes. Congratulations, bronzes. Again, most important rank in the company. Builds your belief, shows you can do it, and puts you in profit. I mean, awesome, awesome job. I love seeing those numbers every week. Another 526 new silver ranked affiliates, people with over 20 people in their organization. A lot of those people did it in the first week or two. Congratulations to our 526 new silver ranked affiliates. Another 85 golds this week alone. 85 people have built a team of over 100 affiliates or members in just, I don't know, some people it took a week, some people it took a month, some people have been working on this for three, four, five, six months. But congratulations, gold is a huge level. Our golds are making between average three, $300 to $1,200 a month in income, which is awesome. That's what this industry is about. And our silvers, we got a lot of silvers in that three to $500 a month range as well, especially when you factor in those fast start bonuses and people who are building and recruiting and finding new members and customers and affiliates. Uh, that's what it's all about. So golds, 85 new goals. That is, that's awesome. Congratulations. Because, you know, we talk, I know Nader wants to say something. One second, Nader. Uh, you know, we talk about how everyone's in, in profit and, and I, I Anyway, it, it's awesome. All right, Nada, what do you want to throw in there? Right, so, so here's the thing, ladies and gentlemen, that silver level, that silver level is when things start getting serious. And when Ben gave you those averages, income averages, remember, it's not costing them more than 33 cents a day to be fully involved with the company, which includes all the marketing tools that other companies charge 30, 40 bucks a month just for the tools. Ladies and gentlemen, that silver level, making that kind of money, as a side hustle while getting healthy, because just like he said, every dollar saved is a dollar earned. Lisa and Ryan used to market these products for about four to $500 a month to people. Now you can get our daily essentials for third of that. What are the prices? So the fact the silver level is not spending $200 a month on auto ship to make 500. It's 9.95 a month. It's just, they just keep ordering products. And another thing, as far as Ben being the profit, I'm gonna stop calling him the MLM profit. Because I just looked at a video he posted almost a year ago. Everything is coming true. Everything. Then he did an update on that. Go to my Facebook and check it out. A few months later, which was like two months ago, it's like, bam. And then look at what he just said in June. Slowly, networkers that see the light are already here. And if they're not going to come in, God bless them. That's okay. They can still stay over there. And if they can look in a mirror and are okay with selling a single mother a $100 plant in a bottle, that's okay. That's okay. We want the everyday people. Like I've said for months, live good will be people's first and last home-based business. Why? Because when you have inflame in Yon, which is live good, sorry, vegans, why would you eat it? What would you go find roadkill, which is a Jurassic age Goliath MLM? These levels that Ben is talking about, the income, when he talked last night about people, some people not making money or barely making money in MLM, we keep forgetting that those companies have a qualifier. That means you have to be buying from them every month to be able to get money from what you're doing for the company. That's the old way of doing it. This man, and I'm not kissing up, go back to the old YouTube videos. He's prophesied every one of these. And now when members start referring members, give it a few months, but he turns it all on. It's boom. Timing is everything. September to remember, ladies and gentlemen, go get five new affiliates this month because if you don't, somebody else will bend back to you. Sorry, bro. Awesome. No, first thing you said, it was right on. And, and I love that because yes, 33 cents a day, 10 bucks a month. So we're talking about, and like Nader said, a lot of these other companies, you might be making a hundred bucks, but you have to spend 120 on products just to be qualified. Here, you don't have to spend anything and anything you do spend, you're actually saving more money. So the best part about this is not only are a lot of people in profit, I mean, over 30% of people, and 
you know, the factor in the people who are saving money on products and that number gets much bigger. But the best part is nobody is losing money here. Nobody has to spend $120, $200 a month on an auto ship. For 10 bucks yeah. a month, I mean, any if you do place an order, you're saving way more money than you're spending. So it really is a cool model. And again, I think the numbers really speak volumes. And yes, we, there's some things we've been holding out on just to kind of throttle that growth a little bit, make sure we've got the inventory, we've got the staff, we've got the infrastructure to make everything happen. But Nader's right. You know, when customers and members are able to refer new, new customers and members, um, I think that the duplication and, and just the, the growth um, and the way that you guys are going to see it. I mean, what we have now, we always talk about and it, and it slowly goes up, but then it kind of stays the same because we keep adding more products and other cool stuff. We're still not even at 50% of our potential as far as the tools, systems, resources. Oh. We're working on a ton of new videos. Obviously, we've got, as we talk about, a new pro promotional product video for each and every product. We've got two other videos kind of modifying the Ben video, as we call it, for the power line system um, and taking out the power line part of that, just explaining to people how awesome this membership is. So right. that's you know, leading towards the membership. And so you guys can go prospect people who don't want anything to do with network marketing or might be in another company, whatever, um, to take advantage because there is so much value in this membership, totally unrelated to the business opportunity and people need these products. So um, a lot of awesomeness coming. And again, when I say less than 50%, you know, we're growing as fast as we are. I mean, probably 50 times faster than the next closest company right now. And we haven't even hit our stride yet. So a lot of awesome things happening. We'll talk more about that later, but let's continue on the ranks. So on top of our 85 new gold, we had 13 new platinum ranked affiliates this week alone. I'm going to see where this diamond is from. Oh, awesome. had, I'm going to check all three of these guys. Two of them are in an interesting language. All right. So we had three new diamonds this week. Three more this week alone. We had Ray Tebe from okay. Philippines. Awesome. This Filipino team is absolutely on fire. We're working with them to open a distribution center there. They're the second fastest growing co uh, country in Live Good behind the United States, and they are absolutely flying. So, Ray, congratulations. Let's see where our other two diamonds are from. See if I can get uh, in there. It looks rock, like Ray. It does. Sorry, I have to say, like Rock, Ray. You rock, bro. <laughs> Ray rocks. All right. <laughs> it does not look like the Korean letters that I've been used to. Oh, it does look like the Korean letters. All right. Two new, man, Korea is on fire as well. Two new Korean diamonds on top of Ray in Philippines. Three new diamonds this week alone. Awesome. Another huge week. Things are continuing to grow and just getting better and better and better. So, um, yeah, awesome, awesome, awesomeness. Let's go out to, let's go to Ryan. Give us an update on products, on inventory, on what we're looking at. And then, uh, yeah, we'll go out to Lisa Nodder and bring in some awesome trainers. And, uh, Ryan, Dr. Ryan Goodkin, Director of Product Development, what do you got for us? Hey, Ben. Hello, everybody on the panelist side. Um, congratulations, everybody, on all the advancement. That's amazing. These calls are so much fun, probably for that reason just alone. And um, so there's so much going on. Ben, you come at 50%. You think we're, I don't know, maybe almost 50% of the way of just providing supporting, you know, content. On the product side, I mean, we're in our infancy. I don't even know that I could say we're 1%, 5%. I, seriously, where do you think we are on product side, Ben? As far as number of products, we're probably, I mean, what do we got? 25? You know, I, I've, I've been talking about 200 products. I think we're okay. at 15% on the number of products we'll have. But as far as people knowing about what these products oh. can do and value that they bring, yeah, 1% for sure. There you go. Man. So, yeah, and definitely a number of products. So there's a lot going on on my end. Uh, we are in stock with everything right now. Warehouse is kicking butt. Go put your order in today. It will ship tomorrow. That's pretty accurate, right, Ben? You'll come up. You'll probably come back to that. Um, as far as I wanted to comment on one thing, I like to keep these things educational. They are training calls on Friday. Methylene blue, a lot of questions. And thank you guys for paying attention. A lot of questions on the certificate of analysis and the heavy metals testing. You guys are right on the money to be asking for that. It is on the website now. 
that was a big one because there's an industrial grade methylene blue. And then of course there's pharmaceutical grade methylene blue, which is methylene blue USP. And that is what we used. And that's, you'll see that's how, and that's how it tested. So be careful with that. And we, we of course use the best um, form of methylene blue. So that's up on the website now, which is awesome. Pipeline is full. You guys are going to start seeing a lot coming out on the performance side, as well as the cognition side, the mental health side. Uh, essential oils are moving along very, very nicely. Yeah. I'm sure Trisha, Trisha's excited about that, I bet. I, I know a lot of people are excited about that. Um, but new product development is really taking on another, um, you know, it's just becoming such a big part of this business. And I love it. I, I just absolutely love it. You guys are sending me a lot of suggestions, a lot of things you like to see in the marketplace. And I appreciate that. That's actually very helpful. So guys, keep doing that. Keep up the great work. Uh, ben, I'll send it back to you. And if you want anything else from me, let me know. Awesome. So yeah, just a couple things about, I actually have started to love the methylene blue. The first time I took it when we were testing it, I wasn't, I was a little skeptical, but man, I took it the other day in my focus. I, I actually meant to take one this morning and I didn't. Um, Ryan actually said that it's okay to kind of swallow it, to put it on your, the back of your tongue. And then I, I drink some water to try to minimize the blueness of my mouth. Cause uh, we know what we experienced last week. Uh, so you can do that. Also, you don't, so the recommended as we, the way we, we kind of created it was to take it every other day. And that's really for just long-term brain function and benefit. Um, but on days that you need to extra focus, whether you're at work, whether you're at school, whether you need to, you're working on something, you can take it multiple days in a row. Just, you know, don't take it every single day. So take some breaks. You know, if you want to take it Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, even Thursday, uh, just take a few breaks. Right, Ryan? Anything That's exactly that right. Good advice, advice, Ben. Cool. Thanks. <laughs> 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 yeah, so take it as you want, but it, it definitely works. And I mean, if you Google, there's some things we can't say, like we can't mention names of diseases and what this stuff has, has been shown to cure and treat. But if you yep. Google it, you'll see all that stuff. And mm -hmm. it is amazing what this product does. Um so yeah, another winner. And again, you know, we talk about it. So many of these products could be a flagship product that you can build an entire company around. And this methylene blue is definitely, definitely one of those. I mean, you could build a whole company around. I mean, this doesn't exist anywhere in the network marketing industry and very little anywhere in the world. And for the price point that, that we're offering it at, it, uh, it really is awesome. And fortunately, you know, methylene blue is, is pretty prevalent. It's not hard to get, so it keeps the cost down. Um, but yeah, I mean, talk about building a network marketing company around it. When you could manufacture a product for around 10 bucks, um, you know, there's a lot of profit margin in there to build a company around. And, you know, the way that we're doing it for, you know, we could sell it for, for $12.95 and still yep. you know, have that profit margin that we need uh, and save everybody money. So it really is a, a I mean, talk about perfect product for a network marketing company that we just totally eliminated the chance that they could do that. <laughs> um, it's, uh, it's pretty exciting. So yeah, one. just another, another cool. And I mean, guys, the products, I, I am so excited about the creatine that's about to launch. I mean, that's probably what, four weeks out, Ryan, three weeks. Something that's like fair. That. Yeah. I'd say so, Ben. And then uh, the new E3 pre-workout energy, man, cool. we don't have a, tr I mean, we've got the energy patch, which is awesome. We've got the aminos that are awesome. We've got the collagen. That's awesome. I'm drinking it right now with my greens. So many things, you know, kind of benefit the energy. You've also got the multivitamin, you got the vitamin D, you got the magnesium, all that stuff. Super greens is awesome. Super reds even has some stuff that, that helps, um, you know, your focus and your right. energy and your concentration yep. and all that stuff. But we don't have a true, you know, energy only product. And I think this pre-workout, guys, when you try it, it is awesome. Have you picked a name, Ben, for that one? We're going to keep it E3. I love it. Energy endurance electrolytes. And that's exactly what it is. It's, it's the enhanced formula that we've created. Uh, doesn't exist anywhere else. What you put together, Ryan, is awesome. I actually had Ryan. I'm like, dude, Ryan, you got to get me some more of this. I've ran out of all my samples. Hey, what's so, up? Uh, it, You're, it's coming, Nodder. Came to the Obviously. warehouse yesterday, and I was I used it this morning, so it was awesome. All right, sorry, Nodder. I shouldn't have told you that story. But bro, I need a <laughs> zip line from my house to Florida. What's going on here? <laughs> Hook the what brother up. Out? Oh, come all on, right. guys. Okay. You bless me. Hey, Ben, I gotta add something to what you all just said, ladies and gentlemen. You know, when we're giving you these numbers, Ben and I have been running software for a lot of big companies. We've been blessed beyond measure. But we also know a lot of things that 
everyday people don't know behind the scene as far as numbers go. To put even 5,000 people in a company during the whole summer, during the whole summer is unheard of because companies die out during summer in this industry because people take that money and either take their kids out to amusement park while they're off school. And this last week, when we put in what, 20,000 paid members in, that's when kids are going to school, people are busy. This is the launch pad. We're just getting ready to do this. So these numbers as a networker, you, you all, I think people have been spoiled here. I, it's just unbelievable. 20,000 people a week at the end of summer, that's unheard of. That needs to resonate with people. Today is the day. That's why Friday is our biggest day because you're recognizing that, oh my gosh, I just watched the Zooms, two Zooms in a row, Thursday and Friday. I got to go ask my friends to take a tour. Have you heard what's going on with Live Good? Just like Dr. Aaron said, back to you, Ben. Sorry. Awesome. All right. So one more thing that we're going to get into our awesome. Actually, let's go out to Lisa. We haven't heard from Lisa today. Director of Product Education, Lisa Goodkin. What kind of updates you got for us? Hey, everyone. Uh, this growth is crazy. And I swear, Ben, I kind of feel like you see into the future, which is really bizarre <laughs> because everything that you, I know you've been doing this for a long time, but everything you say actually happens and it's kind of crazy. So uh, we're all rolling with it and it's very exciting. Um, coming to the products, oh, there was something I wanted to say. Oh, um, we are getting ready to do our taste testing with our children. I know we talked about the children's um, organic gummy multivitamin. I'm going to use my kids to help with that because they've tasted it all. Um, but re besides that, I get a lot of questions about children. Our products, other than that coming, are dosed for adults. Does not mean that children can't take them because a lot of them are whole food ingredients, but they must discuss with their pediatrician. Lately, I have been getting bombarded. And same goes for nursing and um, for breastfeeding and pregnancy. Same thing goes, you got to discuss this with your, with your doctor. It doesn't mean it's no, it just means they know your case best. They know how to dose be best for what's going on with you. Um, other than that, Ryan did mention about, oh, we were talking about the methylene blue. Yes, Ben, you did on the back of your tongue. I, I uh, mentioned that on our training video because I was playing around with it. Literally the best placement, tiny little strip on the back of the tongue. A lot of people are asking if they could put it in water, drink it, drink it with a straw. Sure, no reason not to. Um, just play around with what works for you and what gives you the least amount of, of blue staining. Um, Cause it is part of it. There's really no other way to do it besides if you go to a clinic and get it, I, you know, administered IV, which um, is a big to do. Um, other than that, I feel like I did have a few more things, but my doorbell rang and I got sidetracked. Um, if I remember them come back to me, but oh, um, about questions, please remember about our YouTube channel. Remember that we have gone through to date every single product thus far. We have also tapped into health conditions. So if you have somebody uh, that joins with you and just asks you a question, rather than saying, ask Lisa, because I'm gonna say, watch our video. Yeah. Send them to the YouTube channel because we did these for the reason and they, they'll get their question answered, but they're also gonna learn so much more about it. And that's gonna help them you know, introduce the products to others. Um, and just another, it's just such a great sales tactic too. Um, if somebody, you approach somebody, maybe they're not into the business, you approach them about what supplements are you taking right now? And they tell you, you can give them my email address. They can give me what they're taking and I can help them do a swap. Because a lot of times, our, ours, most of the time, ours are much better, but sometimes they're actually pretty good supplements, but ours are like $35, $40 cheaper. So I'm saying, okay, that's a decent supplement, not going to you know, say anything negative about it besides the price. So regardless, you are always going to have a reason why to get rid of what you're taking and, and supplement it with a, a live good supplement. So use that as a training tactic. Cause I did get an email this morning about somebody. She said she denied live good 45 times. She's like, I just kept saying, no, 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 no. Finally started with the factor four. This woman has been in pain for years with her back. She said, it is unbelievable. She's a 99% of her pain gone just with taking factor four. So keep working on those naysayers guys. Cause once they're in, they are hooked back to you, Ben. Awesome. Yeah. Everybody needs these products, regardless of what company they're in, what their lifestyle is, what they're doing. These products can help everybody. Uh, and they are awesome. So, um, one thing just so we're going to do to celebrate our 700,000 members and we might do more of these, but, um, Kind of excited about this little one. I'm going to try to share my screen here real quick. 
Watch what you share. <laughs> yeah, I don't want people seeing all my pictures of Nodder. Exactly. You don't want that. <laughs> they see enough of this ugliness. <laughs> no, that's 20,000 right people in a week during summer. Y'all killing it, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. Thank you for letting us serve you and live good. Thank you for having fun. Thank you for recognizing what we're doing. I have to say that while he's looking. How's it going there, sir? I can't Profit. find it. Profit. We'll email it out. Anyway, it's, it's a cool we'll t-shirt. That we're going to do a limited time run on this t-shirt. So it's not going to be a permanent product. Uh, we want everyone who wants one to be able to get one. So it'll be a big run. We'll do several thousand of them. But once they're sold out, they're sold out forever. So one time only, but they say, we kind of put together a little slogan. It says, one vision, one mission, changing the world together. It's got the Live Good logo. It's a cool little shirt, uh, kind of a dark gray charcoal color. I think you guys are going to like it. The wording, the fonts are pretty cool. So um, that'll be available in the next few weeks. But um, yeah, oh, one more quick thing. So, man, we are trying so hard to get this German warehouse open. It's just we're packing the orders from our Jupiter warehouse, our main facility. And the orders just keep going up. Now that we're fully stocked with everything, we got the methylene blue, we got the patch, we got the factor four, we got the reds, we got everything in stock. Coffee is going crazy. Magnesium is one of our top sellers every single day, as it should be. But uh, the orders are, this is the cool thing. The orders, the number of orders are going up, which is awesome. But the number of products in each order is also going up. You guys are realizing that, hey, so many of these products can help you. And yes. uh, so that's good. But point is, the where we 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 pride ourselves and do everything we can to get you your orders as quickly and efficiently and as inexpensively as possible. And so these guys have been packing their butts off the last few days, working overtime just because of all the new orders that have been coming in that we haven't had time to pack the boxes, the international packs to be shipped to Germany. We've got two of the pallets done. We're working on two more pallets. Hopefully Perfect. this weekend we can knock them out, get them off to Germany next week and get that warehouse rocking. Um, but that's the reason it hasn't just because we, we, we've been focusing on getting out the current orders. Uh, and then once they're caught up, I mean, they're, they're keeping up, just don't have any extra time to be able to pack and, uh, and ship these big pallets to Germany. So that's where we are with that. That's all I got. Not you got any other announcements? No, I mean, if any of the uh, if any of the local refs want to come over and help pack them, I'm sure we'll buy them pizza. But no, again and again and again, ladies and gentlemen, reach out to everyone that you know, everyone that you know, and say, "Have you heard what's going on? Live good." Yes or no? The answer. Send them your tour page. We are a revolution. It's inevitable. Seven hundred thousand people is not a test. Seven thousand people. Seven hundred thousand people is not just testing the waters. We're the Kleenex of when you get a runny nose. We're the band-aid of the boo-boo. Soon, we will be a household name. Guess who said that? The prophet Ben Glinsky. Back to you, Ben. <laughs> it's coming. All right. <laughs> awesome. We've got some awesome trainers on the call. I'm excited to hear what they've got this week. They always bring the fire, the energy, the passion, the power, the motivation, and the knowledge to help you guys build, grow your team, and just understand what this company is all about. And I am so proud and excited and fortunate and thankful to have such amazing leaders and that we're attracting such high quality people like the ones that we have on this call. It is awesome. And again, just really speaks volumes that, that, that we're doing good things. So with that, raise your hand if you want to go first. Go. <laughs> Nobody's raising their hand. <laughs> I saw Trisha pop it up right before Tracy. All right, let's go out to Arizona. Trisha Costa, you first. Bring it. Hello, hello, guys. These calls are so much fun and it gets me so fired up every week. You know, one thing I can say about this company is my husband, who absolutely hated network marketing since I married him, because I was already in it, I've been in it since 98, has never used any of my products, is like obsessed with these products. I have to put an order in just for him because at the beginning, I figured he's not going to touch this. And he's a physician. And once, you know, he looked into it and he started on factor four, he's like, oh my gosh, the whole family needs to be on this product. So now I had to buy everything for him. He, he takes everything every day. It's the amino acids, the protein. I mean, these products are amazing. So thank you, Dr. Ryan Goodkin. Thank you, Lisa, for everything that you guys do. Uh, this company is so different, you guys, than anything else. 
And today I wanted to share with you guys that I hired a coach for my son, for my 17 year old son, a personal development coach, Dr. RJ. And one thing that really caught my attention this week is the fact that it's all about building confidence, right? Because if you build confidence, then you're comfortable building your influence. And when you have influence, everything you do, you become successful. And that that one thing that you choose to do, you're going to go to the top. And one thing that, um, you know, I learned is that for you to build your confidence, and it's so funny because I've done personal development for so many years, and I'm learning so much with this teenage coach, but it's all about keeping integrity with yourself because he says that we are very good sometimes with just having integrity with others, but not with ourselves. So if you say you're going to do something, do it because that's going to boost your self-confidence. You're like, yeah, I can trust myself with myself. Like I say, I'm going to clean my room and I cleaned my room. So if you say you're going to do something for your business, follow through because it's going to boost your self-confidence. If you say you're going to reach out to 10 people today, don't reach out to eight, follow through. Why have so much integrity with everyone but keep yourself out of it. And then they go through a lot of um, successful habits that we should have, you know, one of them being be proactive. So what does that mean? You are in charge. It's not up to the upline, to the sideline. It's not up to Ben or to Nodder or Lisa or anybody to do your business. Be proactive. You're in charge of your business. If it is to be, it's up to me. I actually have that on my, my board here. If it is to be, it's up to me. It's not up to anybody else. I'm in charge. I can do this. Um, something else is to begin with the end in mind. And I have lived by that. So what is my goal? This is what I want to achieve. And then breaking it down into monthly goals, weekly goals, daily activities that you need to be involved in, and even breaking it down to 15 minute blocks on your calendar. So that's how I have been working for a very long time. And that maximizes everything that I do. Because as many of you know, I do real estate as well. I have a real estate team. I have an Airbnb business. I have a 17-year-old. So I have my whole entire schedule in 15-minute blocks. So I get so much more done that way. Um, put first things first, which means first you do all the work. You do all the activities that you said you're going to do with that integrity that you're having with yourself. And then you play. So never get distracted throughout the day, you know, looking through TikTok videos, Instagram, or even Facebook, first your work gets done. Once you have all the high payoff activities that you said you were going to do done and out of the way, now you can move on to do something else. But if you don't have the right order for things, you never get anything done, right? All of a sudden you're like, oh my gosh, I feel like I've been so busy all day. I haven't accomplished anything. I haven't done anything at all. And then the last thing is, when you're uh, reaching out to people, you know, well, first of all, I have really moved towards products. Like if you guys go look at my social media pages uh, yesterday, everything I did was with um, the new video for the greens. Take advantage of that, guys. Those videos are absolutely incredible. So take advantage of that. I have that on my stories. That is like, I cannot tell you how good that works. You go to, to a story. It can be just a picture of yourself holding the product and then put the link on it. You have to see this. They click on it. It takes them to that video. And I cannot recommend that enough. I, like that's, I'm going to do that every day. I'm going to be going back to linking videos and the super reds. We have those. And Ben just said, we're going to have more and more videos about these products. That has been a huge focus of mine. Um, and that's probably going to be the focus here for the future as well. And so when you're reaching out to people, one thing that I've done lately, because the whole idea of copy and paste, copy and paste is great. You can reach out to a lot of people, but taking the time to really connect with people, um, not small talk, because that's annoying too. When people are like, how are you? Blah, 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 back and forth, back and forth. And all of a sudden they offer you something. I'm pretty straight and you know, straight to the point, but I do take the time to say, Hey, Jessica, it, it's been a little while. Can you, can you believe the last time I talked to you was, you know, when we were doing this with this company and I know that you really care about people and I feel like this is redemption time for me. And I feel like that could be the same for you. Let's redeem ourselves with something that helps the masses. Have you already taken a look at live good and guys, 
one thing that's happening is people now are reaching out. Like somebody joined my team yesterday. You know what she said to me? You know what? I decided to join because live good is just following me everywhere. She's like, this thing is in my face 24 seven. So I finally decided to join. So we are helping each other out when we're out there, you know, as I post, maybe one of your friends is like, oh, I saw this girl, Trisha, but my friend Lucy is in it. So I'm going to reach out to Lucy. So that's beginning to happen because we are in everyone's faces right now. And when they see it and see it and see it, they're finally like, all right, I give in. I'm going to do it. So with that, back. Oh, last thing, guys, we're going to be in Palm Springs next weekend. Yeah, so baby. You wanna, yes, that's we already have about 100 people coming and now. Uh, Dr. Aaron's going to be there. Uh, Tori's going to be there. And Tim Miller, Desiree Ingram, our diamonds, Jesse Garcia and Kelly Toller. They are actually the ones that are helping me to organize all of this. So if you guys want to be there, you do have to register. You can go to any of our pages. We have the link. If you can't find the link anywhere, just reach out to me and I'll send you the link. So thank you. Back to you. Awesome. Great stuff. As always, Trisha, I love the 15 minute blocks. I love the first things first, the end in mind keeping a schedule, being organized, all of that is awesome. And I absolutely love redemption time because I think this is redemption time for so many of us. I mean, I feel like it is for me. We've all been in this industry and and, and enrolled people selling them overpriced products, knowing that they're probably not going to make money and they're having to spend all this money and it didn't feel good. That's why I walked away. And I I love that, that this is redemption time. This is redemption time for so many of us. We're fixing what we've done. We're fixing what everyone else has done. We're fixing this industry together and it just feels right. And it is right. Uh, Great job. Love it. That was awesome. All right. I saw uh, Tracy raise her hand next. Let's go out to Atlanta, Georgia. Tracy Walker, what do you got? Hey, good afternoon, Live Good family, and um, such a pleasure to be on here on today. Great job, team, on all of the growth, the excitement. 700,000 members is absolutely unbelievable. I did a post um, today just kind of sharing some value in that. Really quickly, I just had, I was just looking at a comment, and this guy was talking about the Matrix, and some, I said, do you even know what you're talking about? I said, just stop. You sound ridiculous. Like, I literally just posted that before you caught my name. Like, people are just trying to find ways to come up with stuff, and that kind of leads into what I'm saying. If if you're going to lead a movement, here's the message. If you're going to lead a movement, um, it really depends on the most important thing is your character. And I want everyone to really consider and look at our leadership team. I want you to consider the character of our CEO. I want you to consider the character of our director of product development, of our director of network marketing, of our director of product education. Look at the character of the people that are leading the movement. That is the most important thing. The people on the outside window shopping who don't even understand the language cannot be the people that you listen to. Okay, look, I'm just gonna start with that. So so there's that. So let me ask you this. As we move forward, we've got 700,000 people I want everyone to start thinking as we are crossing over a milestone, right? This is much different. The company today is much different than it was in January, right? Much different than it was in February with 100,000 people or 50,000 people, right? We're at a different phase. And if you're thinking like a business owner, you have to figure out how you're going to show up and evolve as the company is growing and evolving. You heard Ben talk about, oh, there's uh, Dr. Ryan, he's very, very busy. There's more products, right? We're on the track to 200 different skews. The company is moving and growing whether you realize what's happening at corporate or not. And so what also should be happening is that you are growing and evolving whether your market knows it or not. And so here's the question. What's the piece of your character that needs to shift in order for you to grow with Liv? What is the piece of your character that needs to shift? So you have to think about, well, what characteristics does one need to have to even be in business to be a successful business owner to begin with. I'm going to give you a few. Um, Are you involved? Right? Being involved is a characteristic of being successful. Could you imagine if Ben was just he was CEO, but he uh, he's busy, but he was just so busy that he was never involved to be on these calls. Right? He just never, he just could never do it. And Nada would get on every week and say, oh, Ben can't be on because of this, or Ben can't be on because of that. He's involved. He's involved on the back end, but he's involved in the front. So if he can do that, 
and, and have multiple businesses, a family, children, all the things that all of us probably have too, um, you need to be involved because that's a characteristic of, of what we're doing, of leading a movement. Another characteristic would be, do you enjoy what you're doing? Do you have an enjoyment? of this. If you enjoy what you're doing, you're going to have much more success. You cannot have this humdrum, oh, I hope maybe somebody will drop into my matrix from spillover 25 cent and I'm just going to, you know, <laughs> become a rock star. Do you enjoy it? And if you enjoy it, then that means you are now positioning yourself to you're in the way of success, right? You kind of get in the way of success and it has to it has to roll over you, right? You it, success can't, you know, it can't, you can't get out of its way, all right? Which means you have to have it. Another um, example would be um, being a shameless self-promoter. I've talked about this before. Back in my real estate days, I read a book. It was called The Shameless Self-Promoter, right? And that was the name of the book. I'm not promoting the book, but I know that the book is on Amazon, right? It's called Shameless Self-Promoter. And one of the things about entrepreneurship um, and some of the characteristics that people have when they get out of the network marketing is that you don't want to speak about what you have. You don't want to be out with what you're promoting and marketing and have a value to people because you're, you're so afraid of what the response or what the rejection could possibly be or the, the no that you might get. But when you're talking about leading a movement, you have to be in the characteristic of being a shameless self-promoter, not self-promoting from the standpoint of it's me, 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 but shameless self-promoter from the standpoint of we. Look what we are doing. Look what the company is doing. Look at the new products that we have. Oh, I took this product, product and yes, I had this effect. I had this result. I had this transformation. But ultimately, look, it's a collective. We're talking about a movement. A movement is bigger than you. So when you can understand that the power is in the pivot and you know that you're not getting the results that you want or ultimately that you're on track to get them, you've got to be conscious enough to say, okay, I've got to pivot and I've got to look at some of these characteristics and I've got to work on these things so that I can be in the flow. So when the next 700,000 come in, you've got two, three, 4,000, 5,000, 10,000 that are part of your organization through that next wave that takes place. So um, one last thing as I close out is when we talk about character, um, I don't know if you guys got it. I think it was last week, Ben talked about some shifts that needs to be made in the commissions, right? Because some things took place in the system read some things and they had to make some adjustments. So I got an email um, for uh, two days ago, right? I got an email and it says, oh, Tracy, it's from corporate. Oh, Tracy, um, you know, we had to run some numbers. Some of you guys may have gotten it too. I don't know who gets them, um, but your commissions are going to be reduced, right? Like this tomorrow. So I'm like, dun, dun, dun. I'm like, oh no, we can't have it reduced, right? So I reached out to Ben and I said, hey Ben, I got the email about the commissions being reduced. Like, do you have any idea by how much? So he took the time graciously, right? He comes back, he's like a dollar ninety cent negative. And I said, look at God, <laughs> look at God. So out of all of that, that whole email, I was less a dollar and ninety cents. Okay, thank you, Live Good, for not being less. $300, right? $500, $1,000. And so guys, I want you to understand that the character of our leadership, <clears throat> of our founders, of the people at the helm of this, I, I don't know everybody in network marketing, but I know a lot of owners and I know a lot of people that sit at the top of these companies. And I am just, you might not understand just yet because maybe you haven't had those experiences, but I'm just so grateful to, to be involved with this group of people more than anything else that I'm willing to also make sure I'm in the power of my pivot too, because I don't want to miss anything. So work on the things you need to pivot, work on your characteristics and be grateful for the leadership that we have and get your in gear for this next wave. So back over to you, Ben. Awesome. Thank you so much, Tracy. Awesome stuff as usual. Thank you for recognizing our awesomeness, for lack of a better word. <laughs> it, it is appreciated and it is, I mean, not to shamelessly self-promote, but it, it, it is true. Um, and we do, we, we put a lot of effort and energy and, and passion and heart into helping you guys and into providing you everything that we need. And, and uh, it, I, I appreciate you recognizing that. So thank you for that. And yeah, you know, the commission thing, we messed up commissions at the end of the month. We talked about that last week. Very frustrating. I hate having to pay out and then take money back, but we had to, I mean, we're working on small margins. Usually 
you know, if it's a little bit, and we have done this in the past $2,000, we'll, you know, we won't even say anything. We'll let you guys keep it. And then, you know, still give the people who got shorted the money they should have gotten anyway. But uh, we had seven diamonds that didn't recognize a lot of ranks for a lot of people. And so things got messed up. So we had seven more diamonds that had a share in the pool. So the, the ones that really got affected other than the dollar, dollar 90, um, you know, were those diamonds that, that actually had, you know, we paid out an extra $800 on the pool that, that we had to take back from them. Wasn't that they, you know, got reduced or earned negative earnings. It's just we overpaid them and we had to correct it. So um, yeah, we'll always do the right thing. Hopefully that never yeah. happens again because it's really annoying and frustrating and, and I, I hate negative. Um, but thank you for that. And yes, I love the shameless self-promotion. In fact, I just got a text right now. So our uh, it, one thing that's great, one of the many things about our company, you know, we do things really clean. Um, mm -hmm. and, and that goes from, you know, our, from just talking about our banking, our merchant accounts, our processing, credit card, all that stuff. So the lady who who is kind of in charge of our credit card, basically the big banker lady, Ryan and I actually came out, she came out to Florida just to meet us because we're, she loves our account. We're super clean. We get no chargebacks. Oh. Um, so Ryan and I had an opportunity to have lunch with her. We talked about, we shamelessly self-promoted the products. Um, she bought the Super Reds. What? And then she texted me last night. She's like, sorry, I haven't been available this past week. I got sick. And what did I say? <laughs> you need these live good products so you don't get sick anymore. And she just texted me back. She's like, what ones should I get now? So if you talk about the products, guys, and you're, if you think about this, the opportunity to do that comes up so often that now if you focus on it, you'll see. People say, oh, I got sick. My daughter got sick. I, the, someone called in sick to work. All opportunities saying, hey, you need to try these products. So yes. You don't get sick anymore. So you can stay healthy. And watch what happens. I mean, and you're doing a good thing. You're not just trying to sell them products. You're trying to help them. But still, shamelessly self-promote. I mean, believe in these products. Believe that it, it will help them. I've got all my friends using these products because I tell them, you guys need these products. They're freaking awesome. Um, and they're using them because they want to. And they and they keep asking me, what else should I get? I love the Super Reds. I love the Magnesium. I love the Factor 4. The coffee is amazing. It, it really, really is super cool. So, um, yes, shamelessly, same, shamelessly, and it's not even self-promote, just promote. Uh, but awesome. Be proud. What, Roder? We, we got to be proud. We are proud. That's why we're exploding. That's why it's duplicating. It's that shameless mentality. Finally, ladies, sorry to interrupt you, Ben, but, but it's just, you get me going, bro. This is, I've never seen this. 30 years in this industry, to see everyday people coming in on a Friday, and by Friday night, they're bronze because they're shamelessly proud. When you get your first testimony, the minute you place the product order, knowing just in case you don't like it, you can return it up to 90 days empty and we'll give you all your money back. That builds your belief. That's why you're shamelessly promoting. That's why other companies are freaking out. That company that's trying to sell a collagen for a hundred, they're done. They just launched. They're done. There is a day that I used to say six months ago that there will be a day. Uh, -uh. This is the day that network marketing companies that are launching their $10 product and selling it to a single mom for a hundred bucks and then shaming her that the only way she fails if she quits. Those days are here already. Companies are looking at our website. Oh, live good. already got it. What's the way? Let's find something else. Oh, let's go do crypto travel. Well, guess what? Give us a few years. Back to you, Ben. Thank you. Awesome. All right. Thank you again, Tracy. Let's go out to Nevada. Dr. Aaron Oxall. Oh what my God. Perfect. What, what you just spoke about, Tracy, I want to share with you all today how to make more sales through understanding the power and the psychology of storytelling. I like to call it story selling, but this is why. Here's, here's the thing. The person who talks to the most amount of humans will connect with the most amount of humans. The person who connects with the most amount of humans will make the most sales. And the person who makes the most sales will serve and help the most humans. Do you understand when you close a sale, you are opening up the opportunity for someone to transform? A closing of the sale is the beginning of someone's transformation. Okay. It has been said by futurist Rolf Jensen, the highest paid person of the 21st century will be the storyteller. 
Do you understand you're all actually speakers? You own this little thing, this social media thing. This is your own digital stage. You are all speakers on your own digital stage. And whether or not you want to have that visibility, whether or not that scares you, what, what Tracy was talking about, think about it like this. You're not saying, look at me, but you're saying, I am open to be seen so that you can change your life. Okay, so when we're story selling, this is what we want to do. We want to sell the transformation, not the information. Write that down. We sell the transformation, not the information. Let me show you the difference. I could say, oh, the owner of our company is Ben and the director is Nodder and they here, here they are and they've been in the industry for 20 years. No, I don't say that. I tell a story. I say, oh my gosh, let me tell you about these two guys. They were best friends. They were top earners in this industry and they quit just like me. They quit a couple of years ago. They were like, enough is enough because they had a heart for people. And then, then you know what happened? The world shut down and they looked at each other and they said, they called each other and they said, it's time. It's time. It's time to go help people. Let's go. Okay. Do you see how much more powerful that is? Okay. I could say 700,000 people have joined which I am, it's already a story on my reels. Or I could say, my best friend, Wendy, has followed me in every company I've ever been in. I call her and she says, what are we doing now? And she's never been able to even stay on the products. She's a grandmother raising her two grandchildren because her son's in prison. And she's an integrated health and wellness coach. And she can't afford to be on the best products. And she, after 10 years, never ranking up, ranked up in Live Good this week. She believes in this product so much. She went out and made QR codes because oh. she's an Uber driver, because she's trying to make money. And this is what Wendy says to her, her passengers in Ubering. She says, may I bless you with health and wealth? And she sends the QR code to those people. She, I've never seen, she hasn't spoken about any of these companies. She's been so scared. And so she, we went out to dinner yesterday to celebrate her birthday. And she tells the waitress at the end, I want to bless you with health and wealth. And the, the girl's like, I was just getting ready to go buy my vitamins. Okay. So do you hear the power of the story? I don't get on all of these calls because I need to learn how to do live good. Like it's the simplest thing you could ever do. I'm listening for the stories. Do you know how many times I told the story of Tori saying she was the top leader? I got a picture of her going into the stadium to speak. Her company decimated their income and she so now has enough money so that her car doesn't go into repossession. Do you understand yep. the power of your story? So here's a great story. Share your struggle been in this industry for 10 years, never made more than $200. That was me. Your search for a solution. We tried all the companies. We tried 10. Okay. Not, not proud of it, but I'm proud of my persistence and yeah. my transformation. We finally, finally made money and helped set the captives free. Okay. The storytelling is where you're going to connect with the humans. And the number one thing they're asking, number two things they're asking, does it work? And can I do it? Does it work? Can I do it? Does this work? Can I do it? I can say 700,000 people have joined, but people need to know that the Wendy's of the world are making it work. So share the power of stories. The highest paid person of the 21st century will be the storyteller. Nice. Go and live good this week, everybody. Awesome stuff. Lots of awesomeness there. I love May I bless you with health and wealth. That's a great way. Who's going to say no to that? So go check out my website. That is That's awesome. Terrible. I love that Wendy came up with that. Very cool. Very creative. Perfect way just to bring it up because it, no one's going to say no. Awesome stuff. I love start with the struggle. When you're telling a story, I mean, if you look at any of our videos, they start kind of outlining the problem. What is the issue? What's the problem? People are deficient in vitamins and minerals. They're deficient in this one that we're talking about. They're not making money. They're struggling in life. Yeah. What's the solution? Here you go. So problem solution. But I absolutely, totally love all of that. The first thing you said and the thing that you were tied in at the end, the storytelling. 
or story selling. I love that phrase, story selling. I learned early on in network marketing, and I've always remembered this story or sorry, facts tell, stories sell. Facts tell, stories sell. You can tell people about the ingredients, and this has spirulina. I'm reading the, the super green. It's got spirulina. It's got alfalfa. It's got aloe. It's got uh, mar uh, moringa leaf. It's got uh, dandelion leaf. Doesn't that sound great? That's not going to sell the product. But when you tell people this is helping people with their digestion, it's helping people with their gut health, people are getting off medication. This is changing people's lives. That sells. That's a story. And you can tell them about one of your friends that's been using this product. And now, you know, this issue that they used to have, they don't have it anymore. Stories, stories sell. Don't try to sell on, on information. Tell stories and watch what happens. Awesome stuff, Aaron. Thank you so much. Let's close it out with our Texas friend, Tori Cuevas. What do you got for us today, Tori? Tori, excited to hear it. Hi guys, thank you so much. And wow, what an honor. I absolutely love being able to share with you guys every single week. Um, Dr. Aaron, you almost already brought me to tears. That's no surprise, but um, you were 100% right when it comes to sharing your story. And I think that um, I could go off on a tangent, but I'm not. I wanna say congratulations to everybody that is ranked up. Welcome to Live Good, all right, everybody. And I want to talk about working out all right here we go i have just recently got back into the gym and i started um analyzing or comparing what my journey has been like to somebody wanting to build a business okay so i have been out of the gym completely for six months and um you know i often go on a, a commitment run and i i start working out i get fit and then all of a sudden life comes knocks me upside the head and the gym goes bye bye well here i am getting back into the gym and the first thing that i'm going to say that has helped me hold me accountable is having an accountability partner okay and so far it has been my brother and my dad and let me tell you, if you are brand new into network marketing or you have um, been out of network marketing for a while, we're got, we might have to ease you back in to a routine, okay? So I first want to encourage you to get your accountability partner. My recommendation would be who is your mentor? Who is your sponsor that you can lock arms with? I'll tell you, if I had not already, I mean, I am just one week into getting back into the gym. If I did not have an accountability partner that, um, okay, we're meeting at 830. Are you here yet? Are you on your way? I would have already found an excuse. I would have already found one weekend, although my goal is to get, you know, to transform, to lose weight, to get healthy again. That's what I want. But if I didn't have my accountability partner, I would have already started listening to everything else I had going on. Much similar to your business, all right? We want to make money, we need to make money, but as you're just getting started, what is holding you accountable, all right? And if you don't become disciplined enough to have somebody locking arms with you to hold you accountable, then we're already going to start making excuses as to I'll do it tomorrow. I'll reach out tomorrow. I'll share tomorrow. Okay. To eliminate your frustration, go ahead and do yourself a favor and reach out to the person that you've locked arms with, that you've said yes to give them permission to hold you accountable. Give them permission to say, Hey, I need you. I, I need live good to work. So I need you to help me. All right. When Ben and uh, Dr. Aaron and Trisha, all of us agree, this is the simplest conversation I have ever had. All right. In, in regards to sharing it. But what is what's the holdup of keeping us from sharing it? OK. And so if that accountability partner is going to help you um, stay on track, whether that's um, let's go to the next comparison. All right. So I'm in the gym. Okay. Sometimes we can get 
paralysis by analysis because I have like 200 machines that I want to hop on, right? And I'm like, all right, I'm going to knock this out. And in two hours, I should be fit. I should be toned. The 20 pounds should be gone. Yeah, it doesn't work that way. Okay, what we're going to have to do is we are going to have to be consistent and persistent to show up every single day. It's going to take a little bit of action from me every single day to get to my goal, right? I'm not going to lose 20 pounds in one week. You're not going to get to crown diamond in one week. All right. But if you keep, if I keep showing up to the gym and if I keep just putting in the effort, if I keep putting in the work, I know I'm one day closer to my transformation. I'm one day closer to my goal. I'm one exercise closer to getting stronger. So what does that look like in your business? I want you to analyze. I don't want you to overwhelm yourself. Okay. Going into a gym for the first time for me and in months could be very overwhelming. It could be very overwhelming for you starting a new business or getting back into the swing of things of initiating another side hustle. You might already have your business. Most of us have another job. And then this is something that has to come along extra. I don't want you to get overwhelmed and have paralysis by analysis. I want you to take this thing and, and um, set your goal. Okay, and they have to be realistic. They have to be what you find is going to um, be comfortable enough to you that you're not going to throw in the towel. Okay, let's let's um, compare this another way. If I went to the gym and I went hard um, and, and all out, right, I busted my rear in the gym that I was so, so sore that I couldn't show up for a week because I killed myself that one day. How is that going to help my body? Now I just don't want to go, right? So maybe you and your business, you you feel like you've told everybody, you've blasted it. You've been in live good 30 days, man. And you've just gone all out. And then you're exhausted. And you're like, I can't do it anymore. I'm done. I, it's too much. It's too hard. Okay. We've got to understand this is going to be a marathon, not a sprint. Now you can run fast. We have some fast runners, but it's a marathon. So set realistic goals. If it's overwhelming to think of reaching out to, to 40 people a day, like you hear some leaders talk, then set a realistic goal that you are going to continue to hold yourself accountable to. Maybe it's five people a day. Maybe you want to share with five people a day and you need your accountability coach to, to check in with you every single day to say, hey, how, how did you do today? And maybe if you didn't reach five because just life got in the way, whatever, whatever the reason is, because I know that I have to give you grace, you have to give yourself grace. But instead of beating yourself up because you didn't hit the mark, maybe the next day, if you just reached out to four people, the next day, maybe push just a little bit harder because you feel a little bit better. And maybe get that six people in versus, and then, and then you still feel like you're on track, you're on target to reach. But I, some of the comparisons is that don't give yourself an unrealistic goal that you know might not be attainable. And then it's so far out of reach that you already throw up your hands and you're like, I can't do it. It's too hard. Okay. You're going to know your boundaries. You're going to know at the pace of which you need to grow your business. And speaking of pace and speaking of goals, I just want to, um, reiterate one thing you guys and this might make you super happy and it might make the scare the poop out of you mm -hmm. all right we're 14 day or weeks we're 14 weeks away from christmas the reason i'm going to bring this up right now is so so that you don't find yourself in panic mode 14 weeks from now figuring out how you're going to get your christmas list taken care of mm -hmm. all right and i know everybody has different budgets for the holidays if you wanted an extra $1,400 for your Christmas budget, then how are we, I love having the end in mind. And then let's backtrack 14 weeks. And I would like $1,400. Y'all that would cover my entire Christmas. Okay. That means I need to speak to uh, enroll four new affiliate members a week to track on this trajectory 
of $1,400 for Christmas. Maybe that would be my goal. Maybe you're like, oh, I don't need that much. Maybe I just need $700 for my Christmas budget. Then do half. What if you just put two new affiliate members in a week for the next 14 weeks, you guys, that is an additional $700 in your Christmas budget to eliminate the stress, to make you just enjoy the reason for the season and not be so bound up over these doggone finances. Live good is giving us an incredible solution, the easiest conversation I've ever had. But all the training, all the encouragement, all the celebrations are not going to get you to that next level until you simply make a decision. I had to make a decision that enough was enough. I needed to get my butt back into the gym. I needed to get healthy. My weight is not going to drop off unless I have the discipline in place to do it. You're not going to change your financial circumstances unless you have the discipline in place to do it. Set your realistic goals right now. Understand what you can, what's best for you, not what's best for Tricia, not what's best for Tori, not what's best for Tracy. What is best for you so that you are going to stick to? Maybe it's not going into the gym. Maybe it's going out for a a 10-minute walk a day. Okay, so you get to determine what your goals are because you're the CEO of your own life. My encouragement to you is set the goal, be realistic with your expectations, have an accountability partner in place, and have a plan of action. All right, you can do this. And we will all be celebrating at the end of the year when we do reach that 1 million member celebration. Ben, I just want to know already what is going to be the celebration when we hit 1 million? Because I can't wait to get the new t-shirt. But man, I'm already seeing the future of the celebration of 1 million members. And I can't wait for the little incentive that you bring up next. So God bless you guys. Happy Friday. Happy weekend. Awesome job. I don't have an answer to that question yet, but uh, definitely some good stuff. I just want to elaborate on a few things because, yes, so based on uh, Tori's math, four people a week times a $25 fast start bonus is $100 a week. 14 weeks till Christmas is where the $1,400 came from. So that's just your own personally yes. enrolled people. If any of them do anything, you're making more than that. Plus all the back end residuals on the matrix and matching bonuses, you'll get that as well. So it'll actually be more than $1,400. But like Trisha said, you've got to know in order to enroll four people, you got to know how many people you need to talk to because you got to set goals that you can control. You can't control how many people are going to sign up. You can control how many people you're going to talk to and how many people you're going to introduce to live good. So if you have to talk to 10 people to get five to pre enroll and recognizing that if you get five to pre enroll, one is going to upgrade, then you need to talk to 10 times four to get four upgrades, 40 people a week, right? So when you have that accountability partner, and this is a cool thing, and I I love that idea. In fact, Ryan and Lisa, I think you guys should talk about, you know, we talk about um, doing one of your your Monday Zooms on social interactive and, and connection and all that stuff. And I think this is a great way to kind of tie that in because people will do more for others than they'll do for themselves. And when you have an accountability partner, you don't want to let that person down. You, you, and if, you, if that means doing that extra rep or doing that extra set or talking to 10 extra people, you're going to do it just because you made that commitment to your accountability partner that you're going to make it happen. Because if you let them down, then you're, you know, they're trying to do, achieve their goals to make you proud of them and, and to, you know, to accomplish what they're held accountable to you for. Hopefully that makes sense. So if one of you slacks, the other one has no incentive you know, to keep up their end of the deal. So by letting your friend down, you're not only letting them down, but you're letting yourself down. So I love that idea. I love the idea of accountability partner, but know your numbers. And I think Tracy or um, Trisha, one of you guys did a training on that a few weeks ago or a few months ago, and it was great about knowing how many people you need to talk to to get how many pre-enrollees, how many pre-enrollees are going to convert into a member and focus on the things that you can control and set your goals based on those things. So if you have an accountability partner, 
you know, make the commitment. Hey, I'm going to talk to it and don't even do it over the course of a week, because if you skip four days and then you have to try to squeeze it in the last few days, it's not going to work. Do it yes. on a daily basis. I'm going to talk to 20 people every single day or even 10 people a day, 50 people, whatever, you know, really? time frame. And you and your partner don't even have to do the same amount. If one has, you know, a full-time job, one has a part-time job or has more time, you can commit more time. But whatever you commit to with your accountability partner, stick to it and make it happen. And yes, I love having a goal. You know, Christmas is a great one. Make $1,400 by Christmas, make $700 by Christmas. Whatever you guys focus on two people a week is an extra 700 bucks for Christmas. Make it happen. That's Man. not a hard thing. I mean, you could do that talking to probably five people a day um, pretty easily. So that's all I got. Ryan, you got anything to add to that? Uh, no, other than I love that, uh, Tori. I really love that. But don't forget one thing. You got the, the lean body pack for like about $3 a day uh, that can support you. That's right, with, baby. With a, lot of, with a lot of what we're working on right now, coming out with a, a performance line. I mean, there's just so much awesomeness uh, to, to, to be had there as well. So but congratulations, Tara. I'm glad to hear that. Uh, and good job on 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 the on the analogy and sort of running those things in parallel. I thought that was awesome. Back Perfect. to you, Ben. Yeah, I'm I'm waiting for those performance elite products, Ryan. So we need to get on that. All right, we're on it. Chop chop. I will tell you what. You know what I've noticed has helped my workouts. No. It Girl. really, dude. What? I don't know what you put in it, Brian. I, okay. I mean, it, <laughs> it's good it stuff. works. It, it's awesome. It really, I mean, it, so many things. And my joints are feeling better. I don't know if that's the factor four or the collagen, but um, it's working. And, and it, it, it does work. Yeah, it's good stuff. So that's definitely not necessarily the lean body pack, but I'm excited to put together the fitness pack, the workout pack, whatever we decide to call it. Once we have the creatine, the pre-workout, we'll obviously have our protein in there. Collagen is a great one for that. Our daily essentials probably won't be in that pack, but a uh, great compliment to anything that you're doing. So that's really all I got for today. Nodder, you got anything else? I sure do. First of all, thank you, Tori, for that. Ladies and gentlemen, the 1400 that she talked about, that's so real. That's so real. But don't forget, we got a 30% duplication rate. Don't forget that. But always count on what you do because the spirit of the leader is the spirit of the pack. So that's, I love that. That's realistic. Nobody's on a $200 a month auto ship while they're doing that. Because if they were, they wouldn't be making 700, would they? Because they'd be paying auto ship. Number one, number two, a commitment. Someone told me this years ago is commitment is doing what you said you were going to do long after the mood you initially said it in has passed. And that gentleman on my top left, which is Ben Glinsky, he is the example of, uh, listen to me, ladies and gentlemen. In a couple of minutes, Ben is going to ask all of you to get ready for a smile. And everybody's going to screenshot this because I know the world is waiting for a screenshot of smiley faces. So get ready, do your powder, whatever you got to do. But that being said, right there on my top left, the guy that's smiling, that guy right there was the hard. Talk about consistency. Every day he would show up at the office because we were involved in a network marketing company. We worked together. And he would show up every day, clockwork, all the way from San Diego. I don't remember how far the drive it was. And he would have two things, what do you call them, folder things, and he would call people. He would just follow up, follow up, consistently, consistently. Didn't matter if his goal was 10 a day, believe you me, Ben Glinsky would do 10 a day. So when I grew up in this industry 30 years ago, we teach people this. Put five staples in your left pocket, five paper clips in your left pocket. And every time you talk to somebody, ask somebody to take it too. Like Dr. Aaron said, have you heard what's going on in Live Good? Everybody wants excitement. It just let Ben video do the job. And every time you say that and tell me, go take a, take, a, go to, take a tour of my website with your best email, take one of those clips, put it in your other pocket. Don't come home until the other pocket is empty and the other pocket is full. Because when I look at this power line, all that means to me, placement and all that, great, love. Okay, 25 cents. Go wait for it if you want to. Don't be on these zooms if you're waiting. But if you want to go out, out of massive action, you want to hand out 10 people a day to take a tour of your website. Because if you don't, somebody else will. One of the ladies, one of our lionesses just said, so many people are like, oh my gosh, you're doing this? Live good is all over my face. I'm going to sign up, but my cousin told me about it first. So I'm going to sign. It's happening more and more and more. So commitment is doing what you said you were going to do long after the mood you initially said it in has passed. The reason Fridays are so hot is because you all get trained and go out there and do what you're told. 
but you got to do it consistently. Thank you, everyone. Everybody, Ben, tell them to smile, whatever you want to do. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, I went to the office because I had a $400 a month long distance phone bill. When I went to the office, I didn't have to pay for the phone bill. So got to save a little money there and uh, <laughs> make things happen. All right, All really right. quick. Lisa, you got anything else you want to add? No, that's it. I mean, guys, keep up the great work. Awesome. All right. For an honor, he wants to take a screenshot. Everyone smile on the camera. Everybody five. look up one, and two, let's smile. Three, four, one. Smile one, two, three. God, I love us. All right. Awesome. Shameless. All right. Bless people with health and wealth because it is redemption time. That's right, that. baby. Uh, awesome Ooh. stuff. Thank you guys so much. Have an awesome weekend. Remember, today is the first day of the week for Live Good. Go out there, share it. Let people uh, you see all the growth and excitement and momentum throughout the week. That's all I got. Have a great weekend, guys. We're out of here. Awesome call. Thank you to all of our amazing speakers. You guys rock. Great content today. And uh, let's keep rocking. 700,000 members. You guys are on fire. Let's keep rocking. Uh -huh. In Palm Springs, <laughs> one week, Palm Springs. See ya. Redemption time. Hey That's right. Redemption time, baby.